day 62, becoming Christopher Cruz, I just started meditating again, and then, ah, it hit me. One of my favorite things about working with that coach, like, he eventually hired me, and I worked for him for, like, a month, Um, but he had this group of, like, raving fans. It was, like... 30 people where no matter what program he created, they'd buy it. No matter what he was doing, they were all about it. And what I realized is, like, it was a community. Like, I was living out of the country for three years in multiple different countries, tons of different communities and cities and all this kind of stuff, and just hit me that like going to those you know courses with all these people and learning with all these people and growing with all these people and standing up in front of these people and exposing myself and seeing each other's growth and transformation was such an incredible feeling like that felt like family to me I think that was the closest thing that really felt like Like my tribe, like my people. That's what it felt like. Maybe not family, but like my soul family, my my people. Because we were all committed together to personal growth. We were all committed to changing our lives. We were all committed to being a better version of ourselves. And it was so amazing to be surrounded by those kinds of people. And those are the kinds of people I need to surround myself with and I want to surround myself with. Those are my lions. And so I'm I'm working on building this this tribe, the League of Lions, which is people who are ready to start living like lions. They're ready to start being the greatest version of themselves and go after life, their dreams, and change the world. And so I'm ready to kind of build that community around me because it's when you have that kind of community, you can feel pretty unstoppable at times. Yeah. That was amazing. I felt so close to those people and so much love from those people. And most of them didn't even speak English. (laughs) That's awesome. 